Good morning, everyone. This is Zhan from Ai Chongqing. Now I'm on the way to the Great Hall of the People because this morning Chongqing two sessions are about to open here. Deputy teams across Chongqing municipality will gather here to listen and deliberate the government worker report, and we are heading now with some of them. We are now at the Great Hall of the People and you can see a lot of them are taking photos and chatting with each other and I can feel this overwhelming excitement right here because this year marks the first session of the 6th Chongqing Municipal People's Congress so many deputies are newly elected and now let's go with me to enter the main hall This morning, we met a deputy at the opening ceremony. She happened to be a sales manager for the North American market, and we told her that we will visit her tonight and get to know more. Okay, no problem. I'm Shu Yan, and I'm working for the Sensei Group. We have around 10 overseas branch in the world. I heard that this is your first time to attend the two sessions as deputy. How are you feeling right now as you listen to the government work report this morning? Mm, I have to say uh, it's my honor to be the new deputy, and I'm so excited. Everything is new to me. I bring the digital economy talents at the first beginning step to empower the digital industry reform. As a sales manager, I believe the digital economy will bring factory and the end user more profit. I found like today is more and more factory try to pay more attention on the R&D center. They try to develop more new products, high technology products to get more competitive products in the international market. And also after I attended today's meeting, I found out that the government is very support our export business. So I'm confident that our sales revenue for this year and next year is going to be grow up. Today we are at the press conference for the first session of the 6th Chongqing Municipal People's Congress where deputies and government officials will talk about the city's future development and I'm gonna raise a question. Shibu 重庆是全国营商环境创新试点城市一直非常重视民营经济和市场主体发展请问我是在筑起纾困方面采取了哪些有效措施
eagerly. I think the press conference sends a very strong signal about Chongqing's future blueprint in economy, inland opening up, and many other aspects. If you are interested, please stay tuned with iChongqing for more coverage of Chongqing 2 sessions.